Welcome to Studio Biology. In this video on plant anatomy, I am going to discuss the comparison between the simple tissues that is parenchyma, colenchyma and sclerenchyma. Cell status. Cell status is that parenchyma cells are living, colenchyma cells are living with protoplasm, both are having protoplasm, but the sclerenchyma cells are dead cells and protoplasm is either nil or absent. Then cell wall thickening. Cell wall thickening is made up of cellulose and cell wall is thin in case of parenchyma cells. In colenchyma, cellulose, hemicellulose and pectin is found in the cell wall and the cell wall is more thickened at corners. Then finally, sclerenchyma. The sclerenchyma is lignified and it is also having the cellulose. So lignified thick walled cells are found in sclerenchyma. Intercellular spaces. These are larger or small depending on the type of parenchyma, absent in colenchyma, and these are also absent in sclerenchyma. The next is the cell shape. The cells are generally isodiametric. The cells are elongated in case of colenchyma, and in cross section they may appear oval, spherical, or polygonal. Then there are two types of cells in sclerenchyma. First is sclerenchymatous fibers and second is scleredes. The sclerenchymatous fibers appear elongated and pointed while the scleredes are spherical, cylindrical or oval with narrow lumen or cavities. Now what is the main function? Main function is that these are parenchyma forms the major component with or within organs and performs the functions like storage of food, slow conduction of various substances, provide targidity to softer parts. Other functions include photosynthesis as in case of chlorenchyma, is secretion or storage. Then in case of colenchyma, mechanical strength along with flexibility is provided to the growing parts of plant like young stem and petioles. These are also photosynthetic usually. The only purpose of sclerenchymatous fibers or the scleretes is that to provide the mechanical strength. Now the occurrence major component of organs it is found below epidermis and dicot stem to provide strength along with flexibility while sclerenchyma is found in the pulp of guava pears or sapota the grittiness of pulp in guava or pears is because of the scleretes or stone cells fruit wall of nuts leaves of tea and seed coat of legumes also possess the sclerenchyma so this is all about the comparison between the simple tissues in plant Thanks for watching this video.